Hey guys, I'm Jared. I'm Megan. This is Max. And this is Millie. And today we're gonna to be talking to you about one of our favorite van life essentials, the Heart Tools 20 volt rinser kit. Just a quick note, we've been partnered with Heart Tools for the last year. They've been providing us different items and tools to help around the house and in van life. All of our reviews and all of our opinions are our honest opinions after putting these items to use in the field and at the house. That being said, let's jump in. So if you guys have seen our van tour video, we'll add a link in the description in case you haven't. You know that we started out with a relatively minimal build. In the van, we initially only had a five gallon water pump system that came through our sink because we wanted to bypass having the need for a pressurized water system. We really wanted to spend time in the van before jumping in on the big ticket items like a refrigerator or a fixed shower, just to see how we lived with it, what we needed, and what was truly gonna be the best value. So when we first started out, we didn't think that a shower is going to be an essential, but as our van trip started to get longer and we were spending more time in the van, we realized that a shower was very much needed. It's just it's so much easier to sleep at night knowing that you're clean, have all of the dirt and travel off of you, and that you're able to get a good night's rest. It was around the same time that we took our first extended road trip that Heart Tools announced the arrival of this renter kit, and I was immediately interested. And I can confidently say after spending the entire summer with it, this thing is a game changer. It's fully battery operated, which means that it's fully portable and perfect for part-timers and weekenders alike. All you need to do is plug in a 20 volt interchangeable battery and you're good to go. You have reliable water pressure up to five gallons. And what's really great about this is it can also be powered by a 12 volt outlet, which comes standard in all cars. You don't need to have a camper van with an extra battery in the back to power this. You can have it in your daily driver, your weekend rig, or whatever. Anything that you want pressurized water in, you can have it with this tool. So throughout our trip in June, we used the rinse kit to wash our dogs, to wash our food, to wash our dishes, and of course to wash ourselves. Um, all we had to do was just pop up our portable shower tent in the back of the van and just rinse off and then we were good to go. Now all this being said, if you are looking for a full-time designated indoor shower in your rig, this might not be the best option. However, if you're a weekender, a part-timer, or just an avid tent camper, or someone who's looking to rinse off gear, dogs, whatever, before loading it back up into your car or your van, this might be great for you. So, let's talk pros and cons. One of the main pros of this system, as I already mentioned, is that it's battery operated, which makes it fully portable, since you're able to power it from a variety of sources. The first con is the water temp. It's not terrible for a shower, but whenever you're in like cooler climates, like when we were out in Colorado, that evening shower when the sun was down was a little chilly. So we are still trying to find a way to safely and effectively heat the water for showers when we're in a colder climate. Um, so if you have any good ideas for us, please, please leave them in the comments below. We're all ears. Let us know your guys' thoughts. I'd love to hear if you have any solutions for us. The next pro is that it comes with a 20 foot hose. So you can use the unit all around the van without even having to move it. The next con is the water storage. The unit uses a fixed five gallon water tank. And if you're using it for nightly showers, you're gonna be going through that water a little bit faster than what you anticipate. Now it's not a problem for us because we already have extra five gallon water jugs and we're trying to incorporate a potential water solution uh, once we build a roof rack, but it's just something to keep in mind. We typically found that we go through, I'd say like a five gallon tank would last us about four showers. And the final pro of the renter kit is the price. This thing is listed on Walmart's website at only $130. It's completely plug and play, 130 bucks, and you're going to have water for showers, for dishes, for dog baths, for gear rinses, whatever you need. Now, 130 might sound like a little bit of money, but anyone who's in the process of planning a van build or has built a van out will know that 130 is an incredible deal for something that you can actually use on a daily basis. Especially when you compare it to other items out on the market, even stuff that's hand pressured, 
230 is like half the price and it is over twice the product. You cannot go wrong with that price. Even if you're just building out a van and you want a temporary water solution, give this thing a look. I don't think you'll regret it. So in closing, this unit has really changed how we've been able to live van life and made things so much easier for us when it comes to water usage and water storage. And it's also potentially changed the way how we think about our van, which may lead to some future remodels and adjustments of the layout. So stay tuned. We're going to be making some more videos, hopefully some more content, reviewing heart tools and other van tools alike. So check out our van tour video if you haven't. Uh, check out our vlogs from our Southwest road trip. Give us a follow, leave a comment, say what's up. Hope to see you guys out there on the road. We'll talk soon. See ya. Okay, okay. Okay. Oh, no, I'm still upset. Oh, too. FedEx is <laughs> here.